Yazid's, may God's curse be upon him, when he wanted to celebrate his victory after the caravan of the captives were for forcefully, forcefully brought to the city of Sham, he was sitting in his assembly. And he had invited the ambassador of the Roman Empire and the Persian Empire, the different empires that existed back then. While he was sipping alcohol, the holy head of the Mawla, of the Master Imam Hussein, was inside a bucket. He used to drink from the alcohol and then pour the rest beside the bucket that Imam's head was inside it. While he was beating the holy lips with an iron rod. It's a painful scene that was witnessed and experienced by Zainab and Fatima bint al Hussein and Ruqayya bint al Hussein, the daughters of Imam Hussein and Imam Zain al Abidin. The ambassador of the Roman Empire was there. He said to him, O oh, Caliph, I have a question. I want to know whose head is that? And what kind of celebration is this? What are you celebrating? He said, why do you ask? He said, because I have to write a report, or when I return to the uh, Roman Emperor, I have to inform him of the reason of the celebration. Why are you rejoicing? So if it's a common cause, we should celebrate too. He said, well, yes, this is the head of Hussein. He said, which Hussein? Who's Hussein? He said, Hussein, the son of Fatima. He said, which Hussein ibn Fatima? He said, his father is Ali ibn Abi Talib. And if you insist, he is the grandson of Muhammad Rasulullah, Habibullah. This is the head of Hussein, the grandson of Rasulullah, the Prophet of Islam. Then he said to Yazid, Oh Yazid, I am a descendant of not Jesus himself, but a disciple of Jesus. And because of this, many people travel long distances just to seek blessing from my uh, presence. They come to visit me, to see me, and seek blessings from me. And I'm only a descendant of one of the disciples of Jesus. And yet you do this to the grandson of your prophet while you're sitting on the throne of the prophet himself and you're claiming to be the successor of the prophet who's called Khalifa Rasulullah. Then he said to him, Tabban laka wa May God curse you and your religion, the religion that you believe in. So Yazid said, Yazid that knows nothing about diplomacy, he ordered his guards to sever his head. So he ran towards the head of Imam Hussein He embraced it and he said, Assalamu alayka ya Abu Abdullah. May God's peace and, peace and blessings be upon you, O Hussein. Assalamu alayka ya Sayyidi. And then he said to Yazid, that last night I, have a, I had a very strange vision. I saw your Prophet Rasulullah. He said to me that tomorrow you'll be my guest. I woke up. I was confused. Because I'm a Christian. I'm not even a Muslim. I see your Prophet in a dream and then he tells me that I will be his guest tomorrow. I didn't know why. But now I understand why. And then he read the testimony saying, Ashhadu an la ilaha illallah wa ashhadu anna Muhammadan 